Hi everybody, I'm Dee. And I'm Jay, and, and we, we are, are Paro DJ. DJ. We are here again with Mojo. He's right there. Hey back there. He but us. It's munch pack time. This is our October munch pack, which is a little late because, you know, we were putting out Mexico videos. But it's November. You know what? We may as well crack into this <laughs> October munch pack and see how it goes. It seems to be a trend with us. I want to take the book. I don't want to look at the book yet. No, I did just look at I, I saw I, a package. When I take the book out, like, I see stuff. <laughs> anyway, y'all take a peek. Oh, gosh. Look at all that gold. I also just said galosh, and I'm not sure. <laughs> so y'all put your galoshes on. We're about to wade through some munch pack. Might be raining. Thanks, camera. So, I, you know what? I keep forgetting how much pack works. I looked at it too. I'm not allowed to look at it. So first up, we have got Old, old Dutch. Dutch. Quality lives. Oh gosh, they're all dress chips. Oh. Are they really? Yes. <gasps> I've been wanting to try. Have we? We haven't tasted Scott, all dress chips, have we? Scott, if you're watching this, we got all dress chips. What? Dressed. Old Dutch, all dressed flavored chips. Mojo's excited. He's over here. He's so, so excited. That's like the ketchup and the... Please tell me. It's from Canada, too. Y'all, I am... This is the best munch pack I ever had in my life, and I haven't even opened the package yet. What are the uh, flavors? It's like barbecue and... Ketchup? Sour cream and onion. Oh, I don't know. I just made it It's up. basically they take, like, every seasoning you could put on a potato chip, and they put it in all the potato chips. You never know what you're going to get. Well, every bite's different. I guess. Well, maybe. No, I think they blend the seasonings. Oh. And then... Oh, yeah, I don't remember what this is, but you mm. try it. Please tell me it's good. Please. I don't even like Please dill pickle. I think it's like, I want to say it's uh, barbecue I'm and sour like cream and onion. So check. Yeah, they should all taste the same as far as I know. It smells like salt and vinegar. <gasps> that could be one. Oh, wow. Please, is it, is it no, a, it's good. a lot of flavor Holy in your moly. face? Okay, so there's barbecue, mm -hmm. salt and vinegar. Mm hmm. That's all I can taste. That's <laughs> so strong. Mm hmm. Mm. Sour cream, I think. I think there's a ranch coming in on the back end. You don't think it's sour cream? Mm, I'm gonna say it's ranch. Ooh, I need these in my life. These are good. Yeah, these are good. Ever since we got ketchup chips, and now Unless these. Unless it's not salt and vinegar, and it's just ketchup, because ketchup's vinegar. Mm. Okay, I really like these. Mm -hmm. Go get some of these chips from Canada, or just order some. <laughs> when Canada reopens. <laughs> Oh, well. The borders. Y'all, 2020 Whoa. itis has got Canada shut down. Mm. If you are watching this in 2050, remember when 2020 happened? Mm -mm. Bad times. But we can go to Canada thanks to Munchpack. Mm. How does Munchpack smuggle the snacks out so that we can have them? Thanks, <laughs> Munchpack. That might be my favorite chip we've ever had. That's good. There. That's good, y'all. It's a weird concept. It's a lot of flavor. Yeah. All at once. But, oh, so good. I like it. Lick my fingers. All right, I'm feeling for something else. This is also a kind of a large bag. Oh gosh, I feel like we've had something like this before. If it will focus. Bis, Bis Creme Cocoa. That sounds good. Okay. Oh my God. Why are we so blurry? All right. Cameras are hard little, to use. There's a little label on here. I believe this says it's from Turkey. Turkey. You I see like the word turkey. turkey. It's almost Thanksgiving, so of course I like turkey. This appears to be um, a biscuit. Yellow cookies with cream in it. With um, chocolate in Cocoa. it. Let's see if that's how this turns out. <laughs> yeah, I know. So they're that big. There okay. are four. You, that's oh, four. I get my own. Yeah, there are four in the package. That looks like a cookie I've had before. Looks like a Nilla wafer. Yeah, that's except it. it's got chocolate in it. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. Mm, good. It tastes like a Nilla wafer. Well. It tastes short bready. Mm, okay. Nilla wafers taste like Nilla, oddly Wafer. enough. Mmm, <laughs> good. Servings per container, 12. How much calories? Apparently <laughs> a serving is a third of a cookie. Oh, gosh. Because... Do I even want to know? All right, this has to be on the wrong size package. It says, okay, there's four cookies in this package. Servings per container is 12, and each serving is 507 calories. And I'm gonna throw this away. Now. So apparently each cookie is 1,500 calories. I don't think this math holds up. I feel like when they Maybe stuck it's this Turkish calories. Well, somebody <laughs> stuck this uh, this sticker on here. This is not part of the original packaging. Are Turkish calories different? Should I continue eating this? Yep, Turkish delight. May as well. I've been doing so good. Mmm, 1,500 calories. I don't think that's how that works. <laughs> 23 grams of fat times three, <laughs> so 69 grams of fat. Very nice. I really hope that's wrong. Put those away. <laughs> Don't take read a it. Picture of that. Don't read it. Mm. 
Well, I don't need dinner for the rest of the no. week. No. Oh, it's sour straws. Mm. You hate these. <laughs> Sour power strong. I just think we get them in like every other munch pack. Passion fruit. Look, well, if I can get it to not glare. <laughs> These are not your favorite. I like passion fruit. You don't like sour straws. Mm -hmm. I always, I like these. You always end up eating them. I'm, I'm going to have to call in back up because I need my <laughs> Handy dandy. <laughs> Sharp knife. That's something they missed on Blue's Clues. Handy dandy. <laughs> Sharp, Sharp knife. knife. Mm. I know. Let me watch where I'm waving that around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please. Oh, I'm suddenly filled with the passion. Of fruit. Of fruit. <gasps> you want to eat a whole one or are you going to yeah, eat like okay. half? All right. Take one, bite off what you like, and give me the rest. Or just carrot. I know you don't want a whole one. These are better than some of the other ones. Ooh, they are sour. The mm. flavor really kicks in after you chew it. Ooh. Imagine that. You can't taste it before you chew it. I like these better than a lot of the other ones. They yeah, definitely they're... have more of a sour. I think because the passion fruit adds to it lends to that. Sour passion. <laughs> yeah, these are actually really good. Mm -hmm. They're not as crazy sour weird as some of the other ones we've had. I would eat another one. Don't. You can <laughs> if you want to. No, I oh, I didn't even see where they were from. You guys? <laughs> I forgot I had a munch pack for a second. Mm. Where were you from? Netherlands. Good job, Netherlands. Do they grow passion fruit in the Netherlands? Do they have passion in the Netherlands? Mm -hmm. I could just smell that. I need like a candle made out of that because that smells really good. That is good. I would burn it. Could you light a power straw? What do they call it? And just let it burn like a wick. Maybe it would smell like power a candle. straw. Sour, <laughs> sour. Yeah, that. Gosh, y'all. All right, there's We're two more. These. Oof, I know. We got to think of more words to say. All right, one <laughs> of these. No. Uh oh. Sad times. One of the things in here feels like it might be a corn stick. I'm just no. warning you. Oh, everything was so good. Should so I save it for last? I'm no. saving it for last. No, I'm bringing this little thing out first. What is that? I Jammy see. Dodgers. Oh, I've always wanted to. I mean, I've seen them and I hear people talk about them. We've never actually had one. It's got like a little bee with heart Jammy wings. Dodgers. Yeah, it says, um, no, I shouldn't do that. Jammy Dodger Minis. We apologize to anyone we offended. I know. <laughs> so, I mean, all dressed chips, jammy dodgers, we're really making the rounds mm -hmm. here today. This is shortcake biscuits, sandwiched with raspberry flavored jam. Raspberry. Raspberries taste like raspberries. Okay, we're done. <laughs> you might also be from Canada. Really? I would have felt like the UK. So I would okay. as well. The postal code looks Canadian and it says Burton Biscuit Company. Yet you don't specifically say where Burton Biscuit Company is located. To the book. Let's consult our handy dandy munch book. <laughs> Jammy Dodgers, United Kingdom. I was right. All right, apparently United Kingdom postal codes are formatted very much like Canadian, where it is six digits, letters, and numbers. Fun. Good the more know. you know, right? The more you know. Oh, they're so cute. Oh, Is that, a little heart? Yes. Oh, that's pretty. All right, hold on. We got to come in for a close-up. They did the detail work that it's they did. It's really cute. Detail? <laughs> but see, it's too... That's my hand. Focus. There we go. See, it's two cookies. <laughs> and it's got like a little peaky hole in there where there's like a little heart made of um raspberry jam. <laughs> come here. Cute. You're going to see if the cat wants one? Uh -huh. I feel like I should oh, like. He does. No, he doesn't. I feel like I should open it, but I, that would ruin the experience. You know, like, it. no, you, you, the UK is mad at Oh, no, now. I didn't do it. It's actually really hard to open. Crisper than expected. Mm. The jam is chewier than expected. It's good. I like that. That is nice. Mm -hmm. I want the jam to be a little bit more. Mm. I tasted a lot of cookie. Not a lot of jam. They need to jam some more jam. I think what they did is when it was coming down the conveyor belt, they were spraying out the jam and it dodged. And it oh, only got a little bit of the jam. That's when they named it that. That's the theory. Hello, would you like this? Behind the jammy <laughs> dodger is it dodges the jam, but it has just enough to be good. Or it's really good. Yeah, I like that. Heh heh heh, quit stealing my lines. Let's see if this No, is, I don't want a corn is stick. Is it a corn stick? Uh, it looks like corn stick-ish, I don't know. It says, mm-hmm, and then it says... <laughs> Corn stick. Cool stuff. There's cool pe... Is that like a frog? Mm-hmm. And a chicken and a purple... Bear? Okay. What is I'll it? go with that. There is a cat right behind my head. <laughs> it's licking. Stop it. Get away. 
I guess it's a purple bear. All right, what are you, pray tell? I can read nothing on here. Are you gross? And they stopped putting the um English oh. on here so I oh. can tell. Now, judging by the writing, I'm going to say Korea. Korean. Uh, but you know what? We have to go back to the handy dandy munch book. Book. This is called, oh, it is a Pororo Churro oh, chocolate. chocolate flavor from South Korea. I so that. We were right about Korea. Yeah, but it's not a corn stick. It's Yay. a churro. Okay. Already feeling much better about that. It's like being at Disneyland. Except I've never been We've to never Disneyland. Been. <laughs> Let's get our handy it's dandy. Disney World too. Poke, poke. That's what this is called now. Handy dandy poke, poke. I thought poke. it was Sharpie. <laughs> so they do have the churros at Disney World, but. Did yeah, have Emily got one. Oh. Mm -hmm. My sister. Interesting presentation you're doing there, sir. Would you like a churro? Is it chocolate? Oh yeah, it is like chocolate, chocolate filled. filled churro. I thought. What the, if it tastes like a corn stick? Then I will. No, it actually smells. Oh, it smells like cinnamon. So there's even cinnamon okay. on the outside. Cinnamon mini and churro y. Because churro, I guess by default, wants to have cinnamon. Okay. Have you guys ever had those cinnamon twists at Taco Bell? Yeah, the cinnamon crispitas. That's what they were called when oh, I was a kid. That's exactly what it tastes like, but with chocolate. So it's really good. Right? Just like being a Chaco Bale. That is good. Mmm. Okay. That's my favorite non corn stick snack from It's your favorite almost a corn stick mm. that we've gotten. Overall, so good. That's a solid box. Yeah. Even the passion fruit straws mm -hmm. were not that mean to you. Let's make sure there's no, nope, no elusive snacks hiding out. <laughs> That is our five. For that the was month. really good. What's your favorite? Like, there wasn't you, anything I didn't like. If you had to pick one up off the table and eat it right now, like the cat is trying to do, <laughs> don't eat the cat. I would either do the all dressed chips or the chocolate biscuits, because holy moly, even, except they're like 500 calories. So yeah, I don't think that's <laughs> the truth. Yeah, I'm gonna say all dressed chips mm -hmm. or the passion fruit thing. Do you know me and my chewy sour candy? I can't help it. What are you doing? <sighs> we wish we knew half the time. He missed us. I know, but I guess that is it for mm -hmm. this lunch bag. So hopefully you enjoyed a quick trip around the world with us um, and from the comfort of our couch. Yeah. So if you have not already, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Become a Paromaniac today. Socialize all our media, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Yep. And until next time, rock, rock on. on and snack on. Get this box. Yeah. Oh, good. If you still can. Oh, well. It was from October. And it's November now, so good luck. You're probably going to get the November box. If you had it, comment below what was your favorite. Yeah. All right, we're done. Bye. Bye. I sound like a professional TV We're back. Person. Hey. Oh, hey. Bye. Bye.